Hello all you space engineers out there, Commander Kingfish here, and it is day four here on Planet 26. Well, last episode we got our first uh, resource node in for iron, and we got the pipeline built out to this point here. So today we're going to work on finishing the pipeline we got to get to where the respawn pod is because that is where I am going to actually set up my base and we can then uh, start uh, working on the base as well and I got some ideas on what I want to do but we've got to get the pipeline in place and we've got to get a uh, storage uh, pod or a storage uh, unit uh, cargo container uh, set up down there to receive the iron so I think at this point I am going to move the mobile rover ahead a little bit and uh, there we go all right let's close that let's hop into the driver's seat here all right. Uh, I guess I haven't set up, you know, a uh, parking brake. Let's, all right, there we go. All right, let's move forward. I'll just start uh, heading towards here. And that is probably far enough. Uh, we're probably going to have to put in two or three spots. So I think uh, this is a good spot right here. And hop out of here. Now I need uh, steel. Let's see. Uh... I should have quite a bit in here. Let's go with another couple of hundred. And I need one of these. So let's... Uh, cannot withdraw four metal grids. All right, let's see here. Uh, production. Four. There we go. Okay. All right. Uh. Okay. Now, uh, I want to turn on our pipeline toggle. So let's uh, do this. Pipeline. Toggle. There we go. Okay. Uh, let me get over to the blocks. Okay, I think that's it right there. We just need to stay within here and the respawn. Okay, the respawn pod's right there. So I don't. I don't. Uh, we can uh, let's go ahead and just put it in start with that two okay uh, we can weld these up And got to try to remember what I, how I built those. I think I did. Uh, I think we did that, or did we? 
Yes. I think that's there. And then... Ah. Uh, okay, and then we put this one here. Okay. And then I think we went with a half block up. Come on, where are you at? There you are. There. Oh. Okay, fine. Uh, gonna be difficult today, huh? Let's see if we can put that there, and then let's see if we can get our half block in. Come on. And then that goes there. Okay. All right, let's get these welded up. All right. Now we can jump up here like this, except this one out. Take you out. And then let's go do this. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to have to build. For some reason, I am not having very good success here. So let's do this. Let's go four. Let's just kind of build a scaffolding going up. And that will help because we're not going to end up wasting these resources. And... Block there, block there. Block there. And I think we need to go one more. Block there. Actually, we need to go a block here. There we go. And then let's get another block there. That should get us up high enough. Now we can get this built. All right. Uh, that block, and then we need a half block, that in right there, and then we need another half block over here. Is it? Why is it not? All right, there we go. Okay, we got that half block in. For some reason, it just doesn't seem right because I, th unless I'm going one block too high. All right, I'll tell you what, once I get uh, get back on track here, I will uh, catch back up with you. I'm going to run down and take a look at the uh, other block on how I got those set up and just see what I'm uh, doing wrong because it's not uh, stacking up exactly the way it should be. So I'll catch back up with you here in just a little bit. Okay, I got it figured out. 
I was uh, leaving off a... Actually, I was forgetting to put this block in and then uh, uh, trying to put... I was trying to put that block in and then a half block on top of it. Uh, when I actually put a full block in and then a angled block here. So got it in and uh, we've got uh, this one in. So just wanted to kind of give you an update. Uh, I'm going to start moving forward and once I get over to the base or where I intend to build the base then I'll catch back up with you. So I'm probably going to have to put another oh three of these in, three or four of these in uh, to get this into where it needs to go. And that transport's getting further away, which is a good thing. All right, I'll uh, catch back up with you here in just a little bit. Okay, well, I am getting close to getting the pipeline. This is, this is where I want to build the base. It's nice and flat, so it gives me lots of uh, room to kind of spread out and build all the refinery processes that I need. We're not too close to the em ember ore processing outpost or the fighter docking station. And I think we're still going to be able to get close enough to get to our resources in the cobalt, which will be one of the next things we need to, to start getting set up. At a minimum, I need to get a resource node set up over there so I can uh, get some uh, cobalt because I'm going to probably be running out of it pretty soon. And then we've got to do some uh, uh, searching for some other resources. And I do have a map on where they're located. Uh, on this planet, they're not kind of clustered together like in the vanilla. So they're spread out. So one of the things that we're going to want to do next, after I kind of get the get this built and get the iron coming over here will be to uh, start finding more resources so what I want to do is I got to build scaffolding to get up to the top of that so I can put in uh, another uh, pipeline connection which should then start filling up this uh, container and so that we'll have plenty of iron ore uh, that we can uh, smelt down into ingots using that until we can get our refinery set up. So once I uh, kind of get the scaffolding set up and whatnot and I'm ready to kind of build into the top part I'll uh, catch back up with you all. Okay, I've got the scaffolding somewhat built up there so that I can get up to the top. I've got the uh, sorter put in, and which uh, I'll need to set it up. So let's go ahead and get it built out. And then let's see if we can reach that from here. We want to set this to drain all and that should start draining and putting it into there so now let's uh, go up here and uh, let's build the hub and that's complete the pipelines complete if all is done correctly we should be seeing iron being pushed into this container here. And, oh, I bet... Oh, crap, you know what I'm going to need? I'm going to need power here. I don't have power. Alright, so that's the next thing I kind of got to do is get some power built into here. Enough to get uh, the iron flowing through here. And then we can start filling this up. And then we can start kind of planning the base out. So uh, I am going to... Well, let's just see how much power this takes. All right. Current input. 
It needs 250. Uh, a single temporary windmill should do that. So let's do this. Uh, how do we want to do this? And it looks like we've got some more weather coming in. What if... Well, we'll take this scaffolding down. And then I think what I want to do is... Uh, let's... Uh, run... Just... This will be something temporary. And then we can kind of build up... I'll have to... I'll, I'll need to build scaffolding up. Let's go ahead and take this down. this scaffolding over here. Uh, I guess I'm going to have to build it up and out this away. So we'll do it just like this. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Okay, this is just going to be temporary. We just need to get enough power. Alright. That is where our turret's going to be. Okay, this one needs to be a here. there. 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 Okay. There. Okay. There. And that should be tall enough. Uh, let me go and get at what I need to build a windmill. Okay. Wind turbine. Uh, let's get that into the queue here. Where are we at? Where are we? Power, power, power blocks. Drop this back down. We don't need the hub for now. And let's run over here and see if we can't get all the parts that we need. Okay, cool. We got it all. I should close this door. All right. Get this built onto there. Oh, come on. Of course I'm in the way. All right. Well, let's see if we can do it like this. Let's, uh... Build a couple of blocks out to the edge here. And let's see if that's going to put us far enough, enough away. No, of course not. Uh...
Let's get another block here. All right. Let's see if we can get one more block here. All right, this, low. this should put us far enough away. There we go. All right. Let's uh, take that out. Take those out. All right. And I think we've got power. All right, yep, it's filling up. Look at it go. Okay. It's probably not gonna take long to get that uh, totally filled up, but that's okay. All right, let's, we got that for temporary. Let's go ahead and take uh, the rest of this stuff down. All right. Okay. All right, let's make sure we don't uh, cut out the wrong one. All right. All right, so next thing we've got to do is kind of strategize uh, what our next steps are. I tell you what, I'll catch back up with you here in just a little bit. I need to go get charged up and we'll do that. Uh, and then in the meantime, I'll kind of figure out what we're going to do next because this is where our base is going to be. So we want to start uh, kind of laying this stuff out. Uh, I may need to go get some cobalt and we might do that as well. So, I'll catch back up with you here in just a little bit. All right, well, I have put some thought into this. I think the next thing I need to do is start working on the power station. And because that one windmill is enough to run that one sorter, uh, I am going to need a lot more power. Now, with that comes a dilemma that I'm going to need probably a lot more nickel because the batteries and whatnot uh, are going to require a lot of nickel to, to build those because that's what the power cells take. So I think in the next episode, and we're going to probably call it good right here, we managed to get the pipelines completed and we got the base started technically we've got the base started uh and we've got iron coming in uh i've actually already put iron into uh look at that we're already building it up so let's just grab some more iron and we'll put that over here because we're going to use a lot of iron we're going to take a great a lot of uh steel so uh which is good and I think in the next episode, we got to start working on the power station. And I think I'm going to set up a assortment of wind generators, wind turbines. And then maybe start working on some solar cells. Uh, but that's going to require silicon. And I'm trying to avoid drilling gravel. I don't want to have to deal with a whole bunch of gravel. Uh, so I think what I'll do is put up uh, a wind farm uh, and then start building some batteries uh, and then kind of decide how big a batteries and then just actually get a power room built uh, that'll supply the base power and then we can start working on getting uh, the rest of the base done and we're gonna have to go s hunt some uh, more 
ores. Uh, I know according to the explorer's map that they left me, there's actually some uranium that's supposed to be not too far away. The nickel is a little bit more challenging and the silicon's going to be a little more challenging. And I'm going to probably have to run a pipeline in. Uh, and I don't know if I can do uh, a pipeline from the silicon to the nickel field and then from the nickel field to get both of them into one pipeline being sent in. So we'll have to, I'll have to do a little bit of experimenting with that. All right, all you space engineers out there, keep building away, keep your heads low and don't get shot. Uh, and uh, if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps the video out a lot. And please subscribe, that really helps the uh, uh, channel out a lot. All right, uh, with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.